What's up guys, today I'm just going to show you a simple, easy way to do hot grills, like just get a 9 second record. I'm going to break it up into the rooms, the first room, second room, and last room. This room doesn't really count because like you don't go through it as much, you basically just skip the whole room. But yeah, so for the first room, the way you want to start, you want to go. You don't want to go straight into it, you want to bounce off a wall. I normally go this wall, this wall, and then straight into it, just so I can get the maximum speed. But you can just bounce here, bounce off this wall, and then go straight into it. But once you, once you like do that, you want to wall ride this. You can look this way, but don't do it too early, otherwise you'll fall off the wall. And don't do it too late, otherwise you'll roll onto this and die. But yeah, once you're wall running, turn, look this way, and then jump. You don't want to hit this wall, or this wall, otherwise you'll just lose all momentum. And you don't want to hit this too early, otherwise you'll have, you have to roll. And... You don't want to, you want to like suppress as much rolling as you can because it obviously drains your velocity. But once you do that, you, you basically want to hit this area, right here, perfect area. And then you roll off it, jump, don't go too early, otherwise you will have to jump more like harder. Like once you hit this wall, you'll have to charge up your jump more. And most of the time it ends up you landing here or going down here and dying. So you want to sort of get in between like a good roll off here to jump off here. And then when you go in here, you sort of want to strafe. Okay, so when you fall down, when you get a good bounce, go off the wall and then bounce down here. And you want to get a good strafe going here. Now you want to sort of land on the third block from this side. It's a good, good bit to land on. Fourth is pushing it. And these ones, no point because you're not going to make it over this jump with the big rod coming through. You can go underneath if you wanted to, or you can go above. Mostly recommend going above is the easiest, but underneath, I don't know if it's faster, but it's it's possible, I've done it before. Don't know if it's faster though. But once you bounce off here, like off this, this right here to here, you sort of want to strafe. You want to get behind it and strafe around so you're rolling here, you're rolling on this, and sort of, you want to bounce off it really early, like as soon as you touch it, bounce off here, and most of the time it will end up getting you here. But if you do it a bit too late, you'll land straight here. Don't worry, landing here is common. It's just really hard timing, really, really hard timing, annoying timing, basically. But yeah, go around, bounce off here, then you'll hit here. Most of the time you have to do a full bounce here, and then once you do that, you will hit the roof pretty much if you do a full bounce but i don't think that matters you can't you you land here and then you just bounce to the end and that's it you don't need to do this room this room's pointless pretty much skipped that's how you say it but yeah that's basically hot grills tutorial on how to get a nine second record